you recently joined the foundation. Talk about why. We want to spread the word and uh, spread the, the, the knowledge related to more granular carbon accounting and how carbon accounting can be linked to renewable electricity purchase. We think that we have experience there, we have the technology to do that, uh, but especially we also want other parties to help us learn with them. So we think this is about collaboration. If we want to accelerate the decarbonization of power grids, we all need to work together across industries. And we think that LFE Energy's ecosystem is the best suited for that. How much open source you folks do and why? We do have some elements that are open source. For instance, we, we are actually an application layer that sits on top of, of the blockchain. Uh, we, don't, we don't have a blockchain ourselves. And within that blockchain ecosystem, we, we recommend the usage of the Energy Web blockchain. And in that ecosystem, we have developed some open source uh, toolkits and functionalities. For instance, the, the token that we use that represents the hourly con content of carbon of the electricity produced is coming from a non-fungible token. This is a, this is a tech innovation that we, we did open source, that our CTO did open source. It's called ERC1888 is the technical term. And it's basically a non-fungible token that can be applied for the energy sector, like an NFT for the energy sector. What role do you think you will be playing in this ecosystem of LF Energy? We think we can add uh, value, especially in topics related to data access. We have invested a lot of time uh, exploring how to better access metering data and CO2 data across different grids. And we can also bring value in the understanding of the blockchain technology and how it can support into the carbon accounting processes and certification mechanisms behind, behind this.